for you. Oh, Georgie, you bought this for me? Oh, I knew you cared for me. As, as, as you care for me, which is why it's very important that you never breathe a word to anyone about the, uh, you know, <laughs> what with Clarence Thomas and everything. <laughs> Okay, okay. Can I open it now? Yes, of course. Go ahead. My guess is you're gonna like this very much. <gasps> is that cashmere? Of course it's cashmere. Oh, oh a cashmere sweater. I'm judgy, budgy. <laughs> Just a little something for Christmas. <laughs> when I was a little girl in Panama, a rich American came to our town and... He was wearing the softest, most beautiful sweater. I said, what do you call this beautiful fabric? And he said, they call it cashmere. <laughs> I repeated the word, cashmere, cashmere. And I asked him if I could have it. And he said, no, get away from me. And he started to walk away. I had a feeling you would like it. I get to try it on. No, 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 don't try it on now. Try it on later. Oh, no, look. Oh, it fits beautiful. All right, take it off. You're going to ruin it. <laughs> What's this? I'm going to get right to the point. Uh, it's come to my attention that you and the cleaning woman have engaged in sexual intercourse on the desk in your office. <laughs> Is that correct? <laughs> Who said that? She did. Was that wrong? Should I not have done that? I tell you, I gotta plead ignorance on this thing because if anyone had said anything to me at all when I first started here that that sort of thing was frowned upon. You know, cause I, I've worked in a lot of offices and I tell you, people do that all the time. So. You're fired. Well, you didn't have to say it like that. I, I want you out of here by the end of the day. What about the whole Christmas spirit thing? Any flexibility there? Nah. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. She wanted me to give you this. <laughs> 